If you live with a person, it's so different from meeting a person. As soon as them have you now, them have you now how them want you, so they're gonna. Jingle bell, jingle bell rock, jingle bell swing, and jingle bells ring. Snowing and blowing a bushels of fun. Now the jingle hop has begun. Good morning, guys. How are y'all doing? So, guys, when you can't see my natural here outside, I went ahead and I flat ironed it. The cement, yeah, my flat iron it and oil it because I'm just gonna do but my regular bob. Yeah, my bum. I'm just gonna do but my regular ponytail. So, me still have my braid. The braid is okay, but just I go use it back in my hair. But just I go catch it up, use it in my hair because the thing is. I don't know say Christmas I come and I don't want to put on no wig because my edges them keep on a runway. See there? The edges them thin out. Yeah, so I don't want to do too much right now. I just want to catch up my hair and then if I'm even going to Santa Cruz or supermarket or anywhere. My, my always have me here because I'm here at all so it can't catch up yeah so I went ahead and I, I'm oiling the roots I have thick here so the other day when I was doing the, the um, ponytail I end up with cream around it um, relax around it yes we in Jamaica call it cream overseas people call it relax or perm so I did perm around it and i'm just gonna do but my ponytail i have this um extreme um pro expert extra control it's like the got it's similar to the got to be the eco gel well unfortunately tiana can't eco gel go school so i don't have an eco gel and the shop is closed that I would get that I could get one to purchase now. So I'm just like a catch up the ponytail in a one. And guys, I'm on my mental health journey. As y'all know, yes, I'm on my mental health journey. And you know, I'm a mother of three, going through a lot of personal stuff. You understand? So I'm gonna catch up the hair before I put the gel in it. Yeah, so as I said, I'm a mom of three. Just going through a little personal, some personal stuff. I will all the way. We can also say I'm a single mom of three. May I put it that way there? Yes, I'm a single mom of three. And I have to try and be strong for my babies. Yeah, I have to try and stay strong for my kids. Because they need me. And you know, some, most of the times I go through personal stuff. Um, you can't wear them down with a little problem. You have to just put the best foot forward and try to be your best self. I don't think the hair catch up straight. So I have to use the mirror because I'm not seeing good on the phone. So the hair don't catch up good. But actually, they don't want to catch up the hair further down. Yeah, so I'm on my some personal things. I'm on some personal shit, and I where I'm at now, personally, I am happy. Yes, where I am at now, I am happy because you know, as you grow, you get over a lot of stuff that was weighing you down. And it is not an easy road, I can tell you, because I've been in a relationship for 12 and a half years, which is my daughter is 15 now. So do the, do the calculation. So it's not easy, but with the grace of God, I'm getting there. And you know, I'm strong. I'm, I'm strong. I have to be strong for my babies. I have to be strong. And every day you yeah, go feel good, but you know you gotta get up and show up 
I know every day you go feel happy and all of that, but you gotta show up for your kids. You gotta put the best face forward, even when you're breaking down, when you go through rough stuff. You just gotta be strong for your kids at all times. Early in the morning, late at night So, I have to apply the gel Pull it out back and comb it out Because I don't want it to be wrinkled Love you on the self, love on the self, put yourself first, know your worth, and then in the end, we teach people how to love us, or we teach people how to treat us. Yeah, you treat people, teach people how to treat you. If you decide say you are not gonna tolerate certain things, or you're not gonna take a certain things, just try it, and you see how your your life turn out. When you stop accept, ac accepting certain things, stop accepting certain disrespect, stop accepting people treating you like you're nothing, in the end, you'll see that everything works out for your, in your purpose. It, but I just don't want to put in no, put on no wigs. No, I don't want to put on no wig. I just put on my little ponytail and take it off back at night time and I can put it on back at day time. Yeah, as I was saying, we teach people how to treat us. Yes, if we keep on tolerating, 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 disrespect, having people talk down to us, having people treating us bad, that is what we're, we're always going to think that it's right because we accept it so when people get up every day and disrespect we we're about to say yes our body got immune to the disrespect but no you have to switch it up you have to let people know that i am no longer tolerating nobody's disrespect i am nobody i am no longer taking certain things that i used to accept no i'm not no longer taking no form of disrespect from nobody either you treat me good or you just go to somebody else yeah treat me good or you go to somebody else who will accept and tolerate whatever you are doing to them do not care i suffer great 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 depression and I'm at a place now where if you are not in my circle to respect me, go back. Go. Go. Yeah. That's where I am now. If you are not here to respect me, hit the road. Because you have to be uh, mentally done enough. You see, not every, anything. Yeah, you have to tell yourself that I am mentally done before. Yeah, I'm mentally done before you are done, done. I've been with a person from 22. Basically, your whole life revolves around that person. Everything you do, you build with that person. Everything that you do in life, it's between you and that person. So. It's a difficult road because I know that you have to go and plan out life and next way now without that person. So starting from scratch, getting, building back a foundation for you and your kids. Yes. So that's basically it. So let me just finish up the hair here. And as I said, I'm at a better place now. 
mentally I am okay but as I said I've been through my fair share of depression me me easy to get depressed like I am easily depressed I suffer from deep dep great depression easily depressed yeah I tell wasn't like from scratch. I had this ponytail from the other day, but so I never really want to put on it. So I just use it. Because as I say, I'm not really going anywhere. I just wanted my hair to look okay. There. And then what I'm saying too. Listen, don't do things because because society to make society okay with who you are you know what me tend to understand people went through past situations like you the man the mother go through the same thing yeah the same probably hurt the same pain and you know what i've noticed i noticed that they'll use your they laugh after your downfall they laugh after your hurt. They'll chastise you because of your hurt. When they have already went through the same thing. Why do you think so much people end up with so much picking and so much, so much kids? So much kids. Because here what? I don't want to date again. I don't want another relationship. No. Because here what? Each time you go to somebody, if you go talk to them, they want to pick me. I mean, I depend on that. Because children need stable homes. Children need stable homes, children need stable family, children need stable mothers. I know for we end up with so much children where we don't want because a man gonna tell we say yes, we want pitney. So we end up with pitney where we don't want. Not that children are not good, children are blessings, but children need stable homes, children need strong parents, children need both mothers and father, children need both parents. At all times, children need both parents. Yes. So, I don't want to be the mother to go talk to somebody else and then end up in a situation where I have to go and talk to somebody else. No, me not so lonely. And then, let me tell you something. You say love, when you love yourself, when you love yourself and you put yourself first, you don't need another man to define you. You don't need people to define you, you know. When you love yourself, you don't need to go look one next relationship or hop from one to one. That that is where we that is where we end up in situations that we don't want to go in because we feel like we need man. And we feel like we don't man. We are nobody. So we always have to go we always have to end up back a square one with starting over with people all the time because we shout out love. We don't know how to love ourselves. No. We don't know how to love ourselves. So we always are gonna end up back in situations where we don't want to because without man we are nothing. That's so how we tell ourselves you know, without man we are nothing. But I'm not afraid of starting back over because let me tell you something, me love try. That's why I tell people say me love try. Tell me where all of the new courses them are going and I will jump on it. So I always are ready to go out there go try new things. Not with a man. I don't need no man to defend me. As I tell them, I say, my daughter is from an ex another person and then my two sons are from one person. I don't want to be that girl or that person who because me shot a love and me feel like say, me want man or me want society feel safe if you feel safe. She have a man, you know. So me always go if you are in a situations that I don't want to go in. No. Me don't want that. Me don't like that. And then I respect my children so much that if even I'm going to talk to somebody else, my kids won't do. They will never get to meet another person. No. And then you or the internet will never ever meet whoever I'm talking to again because that is where I think we all blunder at some point. 
will making people too accessible to us or too accessible in our relationship or are too accessible in our lives that we feel like we have to post them and we have to put them out there so people can see them and then when we put them out there for people to see them we always end up in a situation where we end up losing the end because yes some people don't know if it will tension some man don't know if it will tension let me tell you something some man don't know if it will tension once they see vagina and once you open your legs that is where it's done for man them think with them penis yeah they think with that part so them don't know if it will tension so if we as females are going to open and dash it from them yes they're gonna they're gonna access it that way and as I said, I'm not looking for no relationship. I don't want no relationship. I'm, not, I'm just for my two kids, trying new things, making money. I don't want no relationship. No, so I'm on that journey. No relationship. And next thing, I don't want nobody. Where? I nobody with me and them not build life. But come to me with your job. Come to me in a certain position already where we can meet. Me have something I do, you have something I do, so we can meet. Me don't have my money and me don't have save, so we can meet. You understand? Yes, I did something enough for we go wrong, so. And I don't know. Me not believe. And then, as we as females, we take up people and then we take our money and, have, and have make them. Like, in at the end, probably somebody ago meet the same person and have more money and then I go, I go go to that person because that person they, I spend more money like what is wrong with you know like there is so much things to this topic like females trying to know where like you know if you take up people because you know friend have one man and you know, feel like so no no nobody without no man I just don't know these like I don't know and I see, like, there's nothing wrong with supporting a man, my taking care of a man, but making me the halfway, so making me the halfway, like, you know, name bossa youths. Why are you always like females always feel so them to boss man, boss man, I want to boss man, and them see a man come come, like, you can build a foundation with a person, you both can start out, but me as female, not take up my money, got take. My money ain't gonna mind nobody like that. No. Like, no. And at the end of the day, we always end up losing in the end because we always feel like we're entitled to take care of you. We're not your son. We're not entitled to take care of no man. Meet each other halfway. That's life. So we start out with nothing and we end up having so much. And it's only fair for us to No, we are big people. No, so we are big people now. So we make a decision to hear what. We're going to do this together until we find other resorts and know that we work. We still work together and be a parent. And that's fine. People outgrow people. And then we as society need to know that. People outgrow people. But when they hear a chat, and the conversation so nice. Yeah, so when I say someone I'm gonna give you the time. I'm gonna serve time for heal for like what hurt to know what cause no pain like let me tell you something. Like when let me tell you something now. How this place is set up. It is so easy for you to want to talk to somebody when you are going through a breakup. And you see, when we realize now with man, them, them make use of the opportunity. So when you feel lonely and you feel stressed out and you feel tired, they make a use of that opportunity now because you're vulnerable. At that time, you're vulnerable. So, them say, okay, may I just look that girl here because she and her man no, you know, you know. She and my arm and nothing, so I'm just going to use the opportunity right now and talk to her because eh, she has want attention. So they give attention for months when you run them. 
them get attention for months you run them you run them you run them but here what them find it useful now them find all of the opportunity to love you up love you up give you all of the attention in the world because you're vulnerable you're vulnerable now you know so them go and love you and people gonna go through them bad deals yes some people will break up some people will break up and go back together years after because you see love the love is a strong thing when you're going through breakup or people must say you go through problems in your relationship like you're not even have a break up like people know say you go through problems in your relationship they make it perfect. You start the opportunity now. You get in your skin. Yeah, them get them get in your skin at the time you know, because you're vulnerable. Cause you're one. Yeah, your 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 significant other not treat you good. Them not have no time for you. And them know all of that now. So what you think them gonna do? Make perfect use of the opportunity. If you just get in your head, cause them the time they know you want love and cha. Why not treat me good man so? Um, Tom, I treat me good or Jan, I treat me good so. Go work with Tom, you know. Jan move and Jan must feel so I can't get nobody and nothing wrong with me and whatever. So we don't know we still. That's how we probably we don't know we still. That's why we easy to get trapped and carried away. How we don't know myself. We're too vulnerable. Yeah. We're too easy accessible. Yeah. But me learn trick and me learn. Me know trick and tactics, you know. Yeah, man. Me know trick and tactics. Sometimes I'm saying, I go talk to that girl, you know. Not because I'm a you know. But because I'm a bit of a boy, I see. Sure. Could I get your woman to me, you know. Yeah, man. Sometimes they don't even want you. But they just want to make a boy and no say. Mm. Yeah, go well, like a you one could I get her. Go and show you how big man work. And them just get you. And the moment you know so full fool and give it up in a less than a couple of days because you're vulnerable and. The boy will give all the attention, the boy will give money too. The boy will buy you two Brazilian here, though. Yeah, man. The boy will buy you two Brazilian here and give you a care of I want like a nice restaurant to show you, though. I see a so big man treat you, man. I know a road code, you know. I know a road code, I'm fire with enough, man. Yeah, man, I'm just say, alright then. Give you a couple bling bling. Boom, they get you know, and they feel like they have you. Them just start treating them, no care. Them tell some to live with a person, are different. To live with a person is so different from meeting a person. As soon as them have you know, them have you know how them want you, so they're gonna. Sometimes you call them for anything, you can't get them. You have to they know me I call you for normally it wasn't like that. No, because they realize that you're vulnerable. Like them get you in a so them get you so quick. That's them just say, alright then. I have her now, so that's why I put her on over one corner. So I left her yesterday because she not gonna know again, you know. She not gonna know again. The jelly are white up me here. Yeah, so them just get you and you give it up so quick and them just say alright then stay right there so never look for the next one now when we can do so too and jar her in and soon as she give it up them the time they know they can't tell them so they man attack galis now oh cause them have you this so them have Maxine this so them have Shirley, they saw. Them have Christine, they saw. Them have Barbara, they saw. 
Gallis then call himself them the time now. Because you were so vulnerable. You were so vulnerable for love, attention. So you know, try to work it up with, with your husband and make your, or your boyfriend and make them know how you feel. You just work with um, Charles because Charles make you feel special. Like a reality still now, trust me. A reality. But when time you go through like break up our relationship issues, find time for heal, bro. Find time for heal. Don't not, not give nobody no attention. Not give no man no time or attention. Because the moment you start give them like a time or attention, them take time. You are giving them access to you. Easier access, trust me, because if you are going to get up every day and text a person there and the person text, obviously, after a while, you are going to start probably feeling love with that person. You are going to start feeling love with the person. And then one thing leads to one thing. You probably say, all right, then you know what so I mean? I can't check you. I'm going to start having longer conversation in the car. I'm going to start sitting down and chat. Till him probably start drop off KFC and he start carrying one, one chocolate or one, one juice and you call him and say, Babes, I want phone card. He starts sending a phone card. She starts sending a phone card. That the time now, here's the here. That the time now, it becomes them win you. Them win you over them the time. Yeah. Them win you over them the time. Um. I got tired of here now. Yeah, them win you over at the time. So that's what I'm saying. When you're going through any relationship issues, I'm not perfect. Me and I know relationship counselor. Me and I know like that. But I'm saying that's experience. When you're going through stuff in your relationship, it's best to work it out in your relationship. Work it out with whom you're going through the problem with. Not your friends, not your family. Work it out in your relationship. Now choose nobody out of road to try to work it out with. Because the moment that happens, you start, you understand the other person, you start catch feelings. So it's best to just go through issues by yourself. Basically, that's what I'm doing. Go through things yourself. I don't know where life is going to take me. I don't know if you have that's whatever. Because I said, love never dies. Like, love not dead so easy. People can't live 10 years and go back, but for now, I'm taking time out to know myself, learn to love myself. I me mean, don't do nothing by myself. My whole life revolved around being with that person, being around that person, doing everything together, Santa Cruz, supermarket, everything. So now I'm taking my time out to learn to love myself by myself and staying with my kids. Yeah. Hey, so I'm going to say, after I break up, you take time to heal. Yeah, you take time to heal, take time to love yourself, and take time to figure out where you went wrong or where both of you went wrong or where you could adjust. You understand? So, no, like, it's self growth. It's growth. You take time to heal, you don't have to argue, you don't have to cuss the back and forth. Take time to heal, take time to know the other person, take time to figure out where you went wrong. Because if you break up out of a relationship now and find yourself in one six months, I mean, I care if you and the person did a, have a team together when you were with your partner. But if you jump the next six months without, without, without healing and finding yourself for it, probably you and the person did not end up live good because with all the trauma from the last relationship or whatever you went through in your last relationship you have to tend to use that in your present relationship if you don't understand so i'm not no counselor or nothing but it's from life experiences if you just left out of a relationship and you're jumping one soon as we say no matter if you and the person was together you're gonna have some hiccups. It's gonna have some hiccups. And I see it all the time. That's why people end up with what that's why I wanna see alright. When I always say people um people are who are your a biatch when you end up dating like a ten man ten man, ten different man before you reach a particular age, twelve different men before you reach another particular age, ten different years before that. It's not you know have nothing to do with 
being a biatch. What, does, what, what I said, it has to do with self-love and self-worth and self-value. Value yourself, you know, so here we're going. Make a boy go on. You can use the rules. They have so much stuff where you can use. Or if you want to talk to, have a one person, then when you, when you need your call, you can say, all right, then we have somebody you can call. But if every time when you jump out of this relationship, you're going to feel some type of way if you say, me feel lonely or you feel like you have to have somebody to comfort you. Think about your kids. You have kids. You know, your kids can give you, it, it probably can comfort you, know, like in a, the way they but your kids can give you so much compassion, so much love. When you don't have children or you have strong family members or you have strong friends, yeah, you have friends where we can, you know, can chat and laugh and forget things and whatever. You know, if you want to date as you come out of one relationship, that's why some of us are ending up with so many other sex partners, throwing off our pH balance. Running up our pH balance, running up our body count because you think it's okay to jump from partner to partner because you're feeling lonely or you want somebody who only can text and make you feel happy. No, a man don't make you feel happy, you have to make yourself feel happy. Remember me tell you that? And as I said, 12 year and a half relationship never cheated, never cheated, never, never, never had another partner since I've been with this partner. If you get what I'm saying, so don't be vulnerable. Not be vulnerable to nobody. Not make the because me lonely or because me feel like people are gonna laugh or five of my friends them live with them man or live with them partner. So who me be me almost want somebody to in after dunking about me not no do me me young see we are my first see them we no, you're only a drag on your words. You're only a drag on your words. People may see me in a situation and say, no, me and I just, I'm just not that type of girl. You know, matter what, I just never see myself around up and down. You know, matter what, I just never be that girl. So learn your body. When you, you see, when you sit back and you take a year for yourself and learn yourself and figure out yourself, you're going to be better partners to the person where you go to. Remember, you're going to be so, you're going to be a better wife, a better husband for the next partner. You tend to talk to. Just give yourself time to heal. Give your body time to heal. Find the love in yourself. Go out. You have a vehicle, take taxi, just drive, go out, drive, go one place, go eat, buy your own food, buy your own two drink, take your shots, and your, you know, or one of your, your friends, you want to sit down and just chat and talk about life itself. But when you're not vulnerable, all right, then, if you're not even like talk to somebody, then you say, all right, you know, say, I want help, me want, better I be that way there, then, or me in a one position, I want help. It's, it look better that the way they but because me feel lonely or my baby father go do this to me or do that to me. Me feel like say me go do it back to him or me go no, I'm just not that type of person. And me, me respect my children them. Honestly, me respect my children them. Me no want them to end up out there and them see ten man a pass and the ten man a did them stepfather. No, I am not that mother. I don't want that. As I said, if I'm supposed to talk back to somebody else, none of my kids will know. Or maybe until I realize, say, okay, it is okay for them to know this person is there. Even though persons, people can change for you, but you will know. Yeah, you will know. Honestly, you will know. So, this is just, I'm just, it's not even going to sing about a journey. It's just a self-worth, a self-love journey that I'm going through. And me just want to do it by myself when me just, here who I'm cook me food, get to know myself, get to know me without having to dress up and put on the wig and put on the all of that to go out there for people say your hair look nice or your wig look nice or you're just perfect or you're just this. Get to know yourself and getting to know yourself is just be you. Not be a no 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 do something because society expects certain stuff, certain you to look a certain way. Be true to yourself, be who you you know how we feel good for no seminar if you get up five times three night put on makeup on my face because people expect me to come out and look certain type of way or me after do here 
every other week because people expect high demands of me or me if you come out and uh, she has to come out tonight and I'm going to see what she has to wear. It feels so good. I am so feeling me at peace. Me feel good. Honestly, me feel good. Me feel good. Like the mental health was all over the place, but I am feeling good. And guys, females, for females, do not bash one another. I don't know if people are going through downfall and people man do them this and that. I don't know if you're gonna laugh about and if you're gonna drag the female and run from yard to yard and chat how a girl this and girl that. Nothing in that if you're gonna care about one another. Uno, uno build up, uno, uno build up each other. Because at the end of the day, the man them not care about one another. Them not this one another. Them not talk about each other in the worst derogatory ways. You not get a group of male that do that. But a fee, the females are always the ones who feel say them fi go behind fake page and care down people and them fi drag you down and them fi disrespect you and then make other people can look on you and laugh. Me just no know why females stay so. And sometimes I always females who are live the worst set of dirty life. Cause you don't know, feel like such you can get up every day and buy the most important wigs and the most important hair. And you know, look a certain type of way. You know, it's perfect. I always want them when I live no life. Man, this or 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 left them for other people look about them. Come on, females, man. You know, you know, may I talk this from my heart. You know, you, you know, you stop caring on people. You know, you stop caring on people. This is not nothing for caring on people. You know. We, we all are women and we all go through pain and pressure. We go through pain and pressure in our most worst way. At this, these times, I don't know if we care about one another and laugh after one another and chat with one another. Nothing in this we talk about. You know, if you see each other road and hug them up and say, girl, you're strong in a girl. I rate you because, boy, you did do this and you build this and you do that. A son of you do females to behave. You don't ever have females that drag one another out. Like females, they never see sacrifices them way. And never female put out there for re in a certain position. But you know, always when they hit rock bottom, you don't have the worst piece about them. And I don't know why females stay so. You don't ever make meals a st ten step ahead. You don't, you know. <coughs> you don't ever make meals them ten step ahead. You know. Cause you know, quick for care down people. You know, sit down in a here just a place you know, care down woman. You know, sit down in a here shop you know, care down woman you know, in a dance are the same thing. But just you know why I want to stay so. You have people actually out there I go through some rough parts. You have people out there I go through some rough days. I don't know, when you know, do certain things on social media, you know how hurtful it is to that person who is going through that situation? I'm, I'm glad I conquer certain things. I'm glad I can certain things. I'm conquer my fears. I conquer everything where did I care me done. I am in a better place and I am okay. I am in a better place and I am okay. From who can get me to come talk about this and come spit certain things and spill certain things, it is okay. And for females who are carrying down other females to feel better in yourself, just remember, say, karma real for everybody and everybody have them six o'clock.